Hi everyone, your drawings last week were so great. I can't wait to see what you do this week. Remember, you need a piece of paper and your writing utensils. Today, we're going to be drawing a cloud and rain. So I will have a pencil for my word and my name. I'm going to use black for the outline and to color in using nice and light coloring and blue for the raindrops. First up, your name goes in the top left hand corner. When you are finished, put down your tools. Okay, the first step for our cloud, we need to make sure that we leave room at the bottom for our word. The cloud is gonna go at the top of the page, making round, half circles, going all the way around to join on the other side. Remember to pause the video if you need more time. Once your cloud is complete, we can work on the raindrops. They start at a point, they're rounded and go back just like that. I already have one raindrop and I want to have six, so I need to draw five more. Two, three, four, five, six raindrops. Count your raindrops to make sure you have the right amount. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now that my cloud and my raindrops are done, I can write the word. Remember that we stretch it out so we can hear all the sounds. R, 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 A, oh, it's saying the sound. R, A, N. You can't hear the I, but we can hear the N at the end. And look at, if we cover that up, it's a sight word, N. Remember, you can use whatever colors you have at home. I don't have a gray, so I'm going to take my black and color very lightly. We've been working on this in class, so you should remember. And I'm gonna use blue, nice and light for my raindrops. When you're all done your drawing, have an adult in your household take a picture of it and send it to Mrs. Flares or Miss Rhodes. Thanks.